Good morning, Bulldogs. I ask that you please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may now be seated. Hey, good morning. Welcome to the late edition of Mattern's Monday Morning Minute. So anyways, I just wanted to tell everybody, it's a, it's a shopping season. Last weekend was, everybody was in the stores and stuff. Be patient, be tolerant. You should have seen what happened. I was in the store last weekend and I got in line to go to the register and this duck was in front of me. And this duck finally gets up to the register and the guy behind the register says, uh, can I help you? And the duck says, yeah. And the guy says, what do you want? And the duck says, well, I'd like, a, I'd like a bagel with cream cheese. And the guy behind the register says, this is a pharmacy. We don't have bagels. You, you know, you want anything else? And the duck said, no. And he says, and the guy says, get out of here. So uh, I got some cough medicine and I went back passing an end cap and I see the duck down another aisle. So I was doing a little bit more shopping. And the duck gets back in line and goes back to the register and he gets up to the register. And the guy behind the counter says, Hi, can I help you? And the duck says, Yeah, I'd, I'd like a bagel with cream cheese. And the guy behind the counter says, Look, I told you this is a pharmacy. We don't have bagels. If you come back here and ask for a bagel again, I'm going to nail your beak. To the, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to nail your beak to the counter here. So the duck turns around and walks away. I'm, I'm getting ready to leave and I look and, and the duck is down one of the aisles and I'm passing the, uh, you know, the, the wart removers, you know, the little pads that go in your feet. And I thought, well, I can buy some of them for my ex-sister-in-law. You know, it'll, they're cheap and it'll, you know, at least help to cover her face a little bit. So anyways, the duck goes back up to the register. And the same guy's behind the register. And the guy says, can I help you? And the duck says, yeah, I'd like a hammer and nails. And the guy says, dude, this is a pharmacy. We don't have a hammer and nails. He says, can I get you anything else? And the duck says, yeah, I'd like a bagel and cream cheese. Have a good day. Good morning, good morning boys. Boys. Today is Tuesday, November 27th. I'm Keontis. I'm Desi. And we are the your daily morning announcements. Hey students, we want to thank you for all your support of the students who participate in extracurricular activities. Each of these students join a proud history of people who have proudly represented West Alice Central going all the way back to the 1890s when we were still known as West Alice High School. You may have noticed all the hard work and dedication that goes into honoring our alumni on the West Dallas Central Wall of Fame. Perhaps you or a fellow student you know will become a representative on that same way in the future. We need your help to keep the tradition strong and to showcase all those who have worked to make Central great. Please encourage others to be considerate of these items and remind others not to take the hardware off of the wall or to damage the plexiglass coverings. New cameras are in place around the Wall of Fame, and anyone caught vandalizing the wall is subject to vandalism charges. Our best defense of the wall is for you to help us by taking pride in your wall. It was made for you. Spanish class toy draw competition. The Spanish class that collects the most new toys will win trolls and chocolate. Please give to your Spanish teacher who will keep counts. Jacob Unger, a senior who is working towards his Eagle Scout project, wants to collect food for those in need during the upcoming holidays. Help support Jacob Unger's project and the Hunger Task Force by bringing any non-perishable food items that you have to your caps. The collection process is going on for the rest of the semester, although the holidays are a particular time of need for people. You want your photos in a yearbook? The phone app replay allows students to upload photos from around the school onto an online database, sort of like Instagram for the school. Those uploaded photos can be used in the yearbook, so if you are at the sporting event, at the club event, or just with your friends in the building, take photos and share with them the rest of the school, thanks to Replay. 
Do you have any warm coats or other cold weather clothing that isn't being used? If so, please consider donating to Interact's Warm Weather Clothing Drive. We are taking donations through Thursday morning. You can drop off any items to your cap teacher. You can also drop off items in Miss Hansen's room, that is room 224, or Mr. Owen's room, which is room 210. Interact is also beginning to take donations for our annual food drive. Donations can be given to either one of those people mentioned. Any non-perishable food items are welcome. We will also have a miracle minute to end the food drive on Friday, December 7th, during 7th hour. Thank you, Bulldogs. And that's it with today. The morning announcement would also forget to be responsible and engage the leaders in our white community. And if you see something, say something. And together we can keep church safe. And I hope you have a good Tuesday. Go Bulldogs. Woof, woof, woof. woof.